The thing I most want to share with you today is something that boggles my mind every time I see it, and I see it all the time. I see people who are carrying a lot of extra weight running. Now, nothing could be worse. <laughs> if you're carrying a lot of extra weight, the most important thing you can do is lose that weight via losing the waist. When you do that, you are not going to have the burden that you're running with when you still have the extra weight and waist. And that burden is very hard on the bones, it's very hard on the organs, and it only makes the whole skeletal muscular system break down. So what you want to do is you want to eat a cleansing diet and release via colon cleansing a ton of waste that will be your weight weight is waste it's very important to make that connection i think i've mentioned that in a previous session in the sauna and then you're going to have a wonderful sense of lightness that's going to enable you to do any kind of exercise you would like without putting excessive stress on your skeletal muscular system now you might think that you have to exercise to lose weight well it's not exactly true simple exercise like walking or jumping gently on a rebounder is enough when you're carrying a lot of extra weight the important thing is that you lose the waste you lose the weight and that's more simply done than you can possibly imagine if you're not eating a cleansing diet and releasing your waist through colon hydrotherapy you're going to struggle you're going to yo-yo diet you're going to wind up feeling deprived you're going to wind up having a very hard time losing weight that's very easily lost when you release waste. So I'm not telling you to forego your transformation. I'm telling you to forego creating a heavy burden on your skeletal muscular system when it's completely unnecessary. It's not just your skeletal muscular system that you're burdening. You're burdening your cells and tissues. You're making it really hard for your lymph to catch up with everything you're awakening through the exercise as well. So you're just creating chaos in the body, essentially. And it's no fun. I can guarantee that you're not enjoying carrying all that extra weight as you're pounding the pavement. So give yourself a break. Start cleansing first. You'll lose the weight. You'll lose the waste very quickly. Really, within a few weeks, you will lose a significant amount of weight. Keep going until you feel you're light enough to be jumping up and down. Now, for some of you, you're just carrying about 15 pounds too much for running. Others of you are carrying about 40 or 50 pounds too much for, for running or more. So until you can run with a lightness of foot, just walk. You can do gentle inclines, walking up hills, that is great. You can walk on a treadmill, you can walk on an ellipse, you can move on an elliptical trainer, you can do a stair climber, but impact, running where you have impact, you're making impact when you're carrying extra weight is a really, really bad move. It's gonna be very heavy on your body, it's gonna break you down, it's gonna make you older faster, and it's not gonna help you get to where you wanna be, and it's also not gonna be very enjoyable.